What's up YouTube and welcome back to Scorchers Lounge where today we're going to be doing an unboxing. Now I know I'm late to the party but finish line sold on your boy bro. It's Friday morning. I received this yesterday night. When you see the sneaker you already know that this should have been here Tuesday. <laughs> Let's do my unboxing with the Brian knife, you feel me? All right. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see if the box is good. You know what I'm saying? Let's see what finish line did to your boy. I'm so stupid. I have a knife, but then I'm trying to rip it. <laughs> All right, here it is. BAM! Here it is. Box is good. Okay, cool. Now, you know what this is by the box. You, you already know what this is. It's Friday morning. Like, kind of upset about that. These are sitting everywhere. I just walked into Foot Locker Monday. And I, had a, and I picked something up, but I'm going to do that video next time. I went to Foot Locker and this was everywhere. Champs, JD. I went to every store and this was everywhere. However, I need to get my finish line points up. So I was like, you know what? Let me uh, get it from finish line. They, you know, they'll be here on Tuesday. Nope. So I'm late with the review. However, I have a good review. So this is the Jordan 1 box in all black and green. First of all, this box is fire. <laughs> I love these like new little twist on the box so it's all black with the green right there the green right there with the size tag and label reads Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG style code is DZ5485 color code 031 size 11 my size black lucky green and white let's flip the lid you got your nike swoosh and then you got the stamp right there let me put this away put this away okay it comes with white regular tissue paper nothing major and then here it is <laughs> anything in the box nope nothing else all right now when these was rumored to come out they were calling them the Celtic ones and I did a video on my Celtic pack my Celtic ones DMP pack so I already did a video on that but I'm gonna compare both of them because a lot of people talk about comparing them because no one has it because that's a 08 pair see what I'm saying not a lot of people have it not well not a lot of people have a video on both of them together but um i'm gonna do that for you in a second so this is your jordan one high og lucky green it come with your lucky green bottom white midsole it got your green right here in the heel and the heel collar it got your black wings logo right there it got your white toe box and then your black toe back toe cap. Got your black Nike swoosh and you got the white side paddles. It comes laced with lucky green laces. Oh, it comes okay. So it comes with black laces as well. You got your nylon tongue, your Nike green, your lucky green Nike swoosh tag right there. And in the inside, it says Nike Air and that Lucky Green. Now, this pair is beautiful. When I heard this pair was coming back, I was hyped, man. <laughs> and let's see if there's anything different. Nope, there's nothing different. So, now let's get to the quality. Quality on these are good. Um, 
Yeah, this is this is good. This is not great, but it's good. You know, this is a massive general release. It got a billion pairs made, and they use good leather. You know, cool, pretty good leather. Now, do we like these over the original Celtics? Let's find out. Give me a second. I'll be right back. And I'm back. Now, you see this big box right here? I already did this review, but the Celtics one right here which is basically the same thing except this is a lucky green and this is the celtics this is more this is what you call classic green so it's a little darker more to the celtics color this is more you know hot, vibrant now this is the inspiration of this shoe right i'm sorry this is the inspiration of this shoe it might not look different but there's a lot of difference and i'm gonna go through them right now starting with the box this came in a special pack also with the Jordan 1 breads, which is in the bottom right here. And then the top came with the Celtic 1s. And the story behind this is, a, is that when Chicago played Boston Celtics, he scored 63 points. So that's why behind the tongue, you're going to have a thing that says 63 points right there. And... This is the hardwood, and then you see the green stripes right there from the Celtics because he did it in Celtics home in a, what do you call it, the garden. So that's the inspiration of the box. <clears throat> now let's get to the shoe. When you compare the shoes, they look a little similar, but there's a lot of differences, starting with the color. If you look at the color, you got that darker green, kind of like the Celtics jersey. And then you have this lucky green, which is more vibrant. These come with green laces, and these also came with the green laces. Then you see the black bag right here. I mean, the black shoelaces in the bag. And then, as you know, um, this come with the black laces, right? So this is basically the same thing. I don't know if they, I don't know if they wasn't allowed to use Celtics colorway or classic green colorway or they just want it a little different so then everyone who has this pair don't feel like oh man now this pair devalues because the brand new one came out not really sure why they did the lucky green but it still looks great so as you see it got the same thing they got that black toe with the with the white box you got the black swooshes right you got the green bottom now this is where is big difference. The the green is totally different. Now look at the back. It has the Jordan stitch on the heel. See that? Got the Jordan stitch on the heel, which means this is the old OE 05 era, you know what I'm saying? Not only that, when you turn it around, instead of having that Nike classic Nike Air they had the patch with the jump man and the, the jump air. See that? That's another big difference. Now, when I did my review of this and I posted it, I had like five people talking about their reps, their fake. What are you talking about? This is not real. And uh, please, guys, do your research. This might be reps to you because like, oh, well, I never saw Jordan 1s with the heel jordan right there what the fuck is that no nah, bro do your research remember i'm old in the game you know what i mean i'm not 22 years old just starting i've been in this zone for over 20 years you feel me <laughs> so do your research all right now comparing the leather this is better this is better leather than this and another big difference i don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up the nike swoosh is actually new buck so you have that mm, suede i mean that new book nike check right here on the lucky greens oh i just noticed something the tab is different this one is that green leather and this one is that suede that black suede now what was that four differences right there and the shape is also different the shape is also different so you got the green color difference you have the Nike right here in the back that's two differences you got the tongue 
that's three differences. You got the suede swoosh compared to the leather swoosh, that's four differences. You also have the quality leather, that's five differences. Um, and that's about it. Yeah, so tell me what you guys think. Would you rather, except for the pack, just sneaker by itself? Would you rather have this pair with this darker green or you guys are good with this lucky green? I like both of them and I'm going to wear both of them. You get what I'm saying? They're different. They're the same. It don't really matter. I'm going to wear all my shoes one day. You know what I mean? It's hard when you got so many. You feel me? But I'm definitely going to keep both of them. And yo, don't sleep on this pair. I'm telling you every this is good everything is good color scheme is good the color green is good quality is good don't sleep on this pair man like if you can get a chance to get them for retail right now go get them because number one they're gonna go up you know what i mean and number two it's just clean and number three as an eagles fan i mean i could wear my old you know what i'm saying my old uh, uh, eagles green kelly green hat you know what I'm saying? And I'll be good. You feel me? But that is today's review. And until next time, loungers, peace out.